Hey everyone, let's talk a little bit about copyright and fonts. So I know that this discussion is a little bit tricky and the concept of copyright with fonts is a little bit tricky because all fonts are different and all copyright law is different. So here are some good rules of thumb that I thought that we could go over. Number one, if you're doing pro bono work and the client has the font that they want you to use, that's gonna be okay for you to use it. The biggest thing is, is that you as the designer would wanna make sure that you trash those fonts off of your machine once you complete the project that you're working on. And the reason why is you didn't buy the fonts and you don't own the fonts. Now, most fonts would be okay and the copyright would be okay for you to do a poster with, um, you know, because they figure, What's the point of having a font if you're not going to be designing something with it? But the difference might lie in the intention of the poster. And what I mean is, if you're doing a poster for an event to just let people know that there is an event, that should be okay. If you're doing a poster to sell meaning that you are going to be making money off of the design of this poster, that's where you would really need to get in and read the fine print regarding the fonts that you are using. Think about it. You can't make a poster of that ITC font that's mentioned in the prompt and just put all those letters on the poster and sell that poster on Etsy or eBay or pretty much anywhere as a designed poster on that font, especially if you didn't even pay for the font. So the same might be said for a t-shirt or cups or other things. So those are the things that you are going to want to keep in mind when you are designing something and when you're looking at fonts. Now, when it comes to those free font websites, if you use Font Squirrel, they usually give you a pretty in-depth um, write-up on the copyright of each of the fonts. Um, so it makes it a little bit easier for you to look. If you go to websites such as DaFont or um, I'm trying to think of some other free websites out there, they might be a little bit obscure about their copyright, which means that the designers might not care, but also it's kind of leaving you open to other people using it, especially if you're using it for a logo type or something. So those are the things that you want to think about every single time that you use a font. I hope that this helps you guys with the discussion.